it was one of those big military plane that you know we, like we, i remember just walking up onto like it wasn't like you get in and out of the door it's more like it, the back of the plane opened up and all these military guys were all you know clipped in and we're just sitting on the floor <laughs> Was yeah. it a prearranged flight? Like, did you, no, were you told no. you had to get there or you just showed the hell up? <laughs> no, my mom, my mom worked for the American government. So um, we were just waiting and they didn't know. We didn't know. My mom's friend didn't know. And my mom was out shopping, actually. <laughs> she was out shopping and then she ran to her friend. Her friend's like, oh my God, why aren't you? They called your name because they call your name on the radio. They called you to, to go to the embassy and get your paperwork, have it all ready. So that's what my mom did. Like she rushed us. I just remember it was just so chaotic. You know, I mean, like, I'm talking about chaotic. We, we were on a bus to get to the em- there, to get into the embassy gate. And if you see the, the way they, they just show the Vietnam War, it's this white, tall fence around the U.S. embassy. Exactly. And I just remember standing there as an eight-year-old little girl with my, my brother, my cousin, my two cousins. And then my uncle, who wasn't going, he was just helping us get there. And then my mom. And it was just crazy.